We present the program processing the current voltage characteristics of the cylindrical probe. This program allows you to define the main characteristics of the plasma. Electron and ion densities, plasma and floating potentials, the average temperature of the electron, the electron energy distribution function, and the electron energy probability function. A feature of this program is its interactive mode, allowing quickly adjust some parameters. The program is designed by Yuri Tsargorodsov, Associate Professor of Physics, Faculty of Electronics at the Moscow State Forest University. He was assisted by Associate Professor Igor Usatov and Professor Nikolai Polyaktov. The program is written in LabVIEW 8 using mathematical software packages MathLab. This is program interface, which has two graphic windows. Run the program. Choosing a mass buffer gas, which produces a discharge. Putty is agon. Set the probe parameters. Length 4.5 mm. Diameter 0 0.35 mm. Load the processing file. In its name is written the date of measurement. Top windows shows the current voltage characteristic. At the vertical axis is the probe current in milliampers. At the horizontal axis is the probe voltage from the minus 80 to plus 35 volts. The current voltage characteristic contains 576 pairs of points. Smooth the data by B-splines or Savitsky Galai methods to calculate first and second derivatives. We select the filter of Savitsky Galai. In the bottom window, appears the second derivative, which is then used to determine the electron energy distribution function. It can be seen that it is very noisy. Change the smoothing parameter. Now well. In the top window, the smoothed black line superimposed on the red experimental line. It is important to not to ever smooth the measured curve, otherwise the results of the cal calculation are distorted. Using the button, we can increase the graph to see the details. The The table of results shows the value of the floating potential of the, of the plasma, UF, 
and the plasma potential U S. The plasma potential is determined by the maximum of the first derivative and the floating potential is determined at zero of probe current. To start the procedure for determining the electron temperature, we push the button T electrons. The bottom window shows the logarithm of the first derivative of the probe current versus its voltage and the range from the floating potential to the maximum of the first derivative. In this case, the logarithm shows the nearly straight line. Use marker to choose the linear region of, curve, of the curve. The electron temperature is determined from the slope of the logarithm of the first derivative. The table of results shows the value of the electron temperature. We determine the electron energy distribution function using the theory of Drew Stein. Push the button EEDF. In the bottom window appears the distribution function. Use the marker to choose the region where the signal to the noise ratio becomes small. In the bottom window appears three curves. Experimental curve is black, green and red are Maxwell and Drivestein distribution functions respectively. All functions are built for the same average electron temperature obtained by integrating the experimental distribution function. The average electron temperature and the electron density calculated from the integration distribution function are recorded in the table of the results. Save data of the distribution function in the file by pressing EEDF button. Next, we calculate the electron and ion densities using the probe model by Bernstein, Rabinovich, Laframboise. The parameterization proposed by Mausbach is applied for practical use of this theory. Program processing is performed as follows. Smoothing current voltage characteristic is converted to the so-called normalized poten potential He, which is equal to the ratio of the potential difference of the probe and the plasma potential to the electron temperature. Then current voltage characteristic is divided into three sections. The region of the ion saturation current, the transition region of the electron current and the branch electron saturation current. Each of these sections is approximated by a function of the type of A multiply B plus He in the bracket to the power of C. Nonlinear approximation is made by levenberg mcquart method. The ion density is restored by Sonnen method. Push the button Laframboise. The bottom window shows 
the electronic part of the current voltage characteristic. And the transition area of, of the characteristic is a green approximation line it end in the electron saturation region is a red line approximation. To achieve a better match lines approximation, we can change the values of the electron temperature and plasma potential. We can also be changed the border sections of approximation. It is possible to see the effect of these parameters on the obtained values of electron densities. Thus, it is possible to produce a numerical simulation of approximation. The table of results appears the value values of the electron density the table of result shows values the electron density determined from the transition region NEM and from the saturation current region NEE. Thus, in the table, we have three values of the electron densities determined by different methods. In our experience, we believe that values of the electron density calculated from transition and saturation regions more reliable. These values are within 5% error. The ion densities N i calculated by the Laframboys method is a half times higher than the electron density. Next, we determine the ion density and ion current density by two methods. The method of Chen and Allen Boyd Reynolds. Push the button V float. The bottom windows shows the measured ion saturation current, black line, and the curve of approximation, red line. The table of res results shows the calculated values of the ion current by chain method, NIVF in the bracket, and by the uh, <coughs> Allen boiled Reynolds method N I A B R. We note that the ion density calculated by the method of the Allen boiled Reynolds is in good agreement with the electron density. Methods of Chen and Lafram boys overestimate the electron density. Next, we determine the function, function of the electron energy probability function. Push the button EEPF. The bottom windows show the normalized probability function, black curve, on the logarithmic scale. Displayed only the fallen branch of its curve and uh, the probability function according to Maxwell distribution, a red straight line. Both curves are plotted for the same average electron temperature which was defined earlier. Save the probability function in the file by pressing the button save EEPF. In summary, 
the results obtained, obtained from the left table can be moved to the right table and then can be go through the entire process changing some parameters. Then can be compare the tables and figure out how the, the changed parameters affect the final results.